I'm delighted to be joined by Jamal Loza today, sponsors Man of the Match. Um, Jamal, that's two games in a row you've been Man of the Match, isn't it? Yeah, I don't, I, I'm not sure how I got this one today, to be fair. Um, there was loads of loads of um, eight, nine, or ten performances. So I think I think anyone could have got it. But um, yeah, I'm delighted to, to get my. So what mark out of ten would you give yourself? Oh, definitely not one of them. <laughs> Maybe a five or six, but I'll take it. <laughs> so wh- why do you think you were picked then? Uh, maybe because I set up the winning goal. I think it was a yeah. it was a good move from the boys. Great kick out from Rossi, and we caught them in the counter attack. And um, yeah, I put in a good ball for Heidi um, to score the winner. So um, I think that was why. Yeah, that was uh, that was quite a moment, wasn't it? To to beat Bromley at home after uh, the run we've had recently and so on. Yeah. But and we're we're on another run now, aren't we? That's yeah. four games, three wins, and one draw. Yeah. No, we, we we've been excellent, and even. Before that, we've had some really good performances where it just hasn't dropped for us. But I think it's now starting to click. The boys, we we found that we found a little formula. So we've, the last four games, we've been we've been excellent. We've got some good results, and we're, we're going to try to continue that for as long as possible. And uh, the famous Tuesday hoodoo. Yeah. The previous six games, five losses, yeah. and yet tonight we go and win. Funny old game. Yeah, it is. To be fair, I think um, everyone was fired up today. Um, we we lost. To Bromley before and they kind of come here with a, with a big time attitude and didn't really show us any respect so f- straight from the off all the boys were fired up even more than usual like um, really wanting to, to, to get the three points. Do you think it's an, an advantage for us to be playing on real grass since they play so much on uh, 3G or 4G whatever it is? Yeah definitely I think um, I used to play on 3G at Maidstone and when we used to go away to to away grounds, it, it is a different different um, mentality switch because the ball bounce is different and um, there, there's no there's bubbles and stuff like that. So I think for them it is definitely a dif- disadvantage. But on the flip side, it's obviously an advantage when they do play at home. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Let's uh, turn back to Saturday. Uh, what a night that was in horrific conditions. Was it? D- 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 do you are you aware of that when you're playing, or does it the fact that it's pouring down and windy and does it just not bother you because you're concentrating on the foot on the game? Yeah, to be fair, like I wouldn't. I've, I've played in much worse conditions. I didn't yeah. think it was that bad. To be fair, okay. um, yeah, I, I thought it was a great game. To be fair, I enjoyed. I enjoyed myself playing out there, and um, yeah, it was it was obviously a bit extra special because you know your your loved ones and that are watching on TV. So um, yeah, I was. I think everyone gave it their rule and what a great result. And uh, you got your, your two minutes of fame being interviewed with Heidi at the end as the man of the match. Yeah. Have yeah. you been interviewed live on TV before? Yeah, I have to be fair, but right. um, yeah, no, that one was that one was special. I think um, um, just because of the performance and um, the win, and and obviously um, getting getting the three points to to put us back in the playoffs, sure. it meant a lot. So I was I was really delighted. And uh, that what happens with that is the man of the match gets um, a donation from BT Sport to give to their favourite charity. Have you had a time time to think yet where you, where it's going to go? No, I haven't. To be fair, it's been a quick turnaround to this game. Yeah, so, sure. Um, they said they will contact the club and, and ask me, but I haven't heard anything as of yet. But um, yeah, I'll, um, I'll be th- I'll think about that tonight and um, yeah, let them know. Okay, great. Yeah. And. Uh, who would you have given man of the match to? I've asked that lots of times. This um, season, not just definitely, picking on you. definitely Heidi. Um, I think he was he was excellent today. Probably one of the best games I've seen him have. Um, he held the ball up. It stuck, and um, it allowed the midfielders to, to to get on and 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 support the attack. So yeah, I think I would have given it to him. Brilliant. And uh, on to Saturday, they'll be quaking in their boots in Borum Wood, won't they? Yeah. After the the little run we're putting together. Yeah. Um, yeah. To be fair, I think I think. Everyone will be wary of us now, um, as they should, because we've been we, we've been doing well the last few games. But I don't think we can get too carried away. We need to um, like realize what got us here in the first place, working hard and being in people's faces, and, and do that again. I'm sure we'll be fine. Absolutely, perfect. Many thanks. Congratulations again on your performances, not just tonight but Saturday as well. Cheers, thank you. Thanks, you. Cheers.